Hello and welcome to my first part of a Final Fantasy 1 Pixel Remaster playthrough. Uh, let's get this going. As you can see, I did get the Final Fantasy 6 text uh, font mod. You know, I just didn't like the way that the crushed font looked on the official release stuff, so... This font here that you see is actually from Final Fantasy 6. So let's get in here and... Uh, looks like I can't type with that, so we'll go. Timmy, my warrior. Okay. Let's look at all the classes here. Backspace. Kind of a weird, a weird controller scheme and backspace to do that. We'll do Lisa. Lisa, my white mage. I can't go without a white mage. I've tried playing Final Fantasy 1 before without a white mage. I can't do it. This will be Lenny. Yes, I'm going to use Lenny. In the last playthrough I did, I did a red mage. So I'm probably... It's just too easy with a red mage. It's just way too easy. And I don't know how this version's gonna be, because I usually... If I get a hanker to play Final Fantasy, I'll do... You know... Kind of like a Game Boy Advance playthrough, or I'll play through on an emulator for Game Boy Advance. Just so that I can... Because I, I like that version quite a bit. And that's the uh, Final Fantasy Dawn of Souls. Uh, and I, I really like having a black mage over a red mage. Oh, look at this. Suggested names. Well, let's try that out. Korad. Ruckus. Glitz. We'll, we'll do a Glitz. Ryko. Siren. Morgan. That's kind of a guy. Claire. We'll do a Claire. There you go. Frankie. Loris. Yeah, we'll do him as Morgan. There you go. Be a little tribute to Crown Trigger there. Okay, how do I... Done. Yeah, so I'm to begin this game with this party. I heard they added, like... Oh, yeah. Here we go. A little in-game cutscene here. The world lies shrouded in darkness. The winds die. The seas rage. The Earth Decays. But the people believe in a prophecy, patiently awaiting its fulfillment. When darkness veils the world, four warriors of light shall come. After a long journey, Four young travelers did at last appear. And in the hand of each was clutched a crystal. Oh. Whoa. Let me just go right into the. Switch party member left and right. You can change party members? Oh my gosh. Page up into... Oh, well, I guess that's gone. Oh no, there we go. There's a button for it. Page up, page down. Minimap. Oh, that's so nice. Because in the Game Boy Advance, the minimap is like left direction and B at the same time. Or like left direction, B and select or something ridiculous. Uh, let's see. Back And let me know in the comments, too, if this game is too loud, I can balance the audio, because, you know, I did some test recording and it seemed alright, so... Uh, let's see what we got here. Equipment... You can see how much the text difference is amazing, you know, I booted this game up with the original text and I said, it's not good. No way. Oh, this is what they mean by left and 
left and right bumper to change characters, not that you can do it in battle. I do like this layout. I really like this layout. It's really clean. You know, I like that it shows the accuracy, because that, that's one of the things you don't really... In Final Fantasy 1, accuracy is such a huge part of your attack. And because accuracy increases how many times you actually hit them. Because you can hit them five, six times. And if your accuracy is really low, it doesn't help. But it looks like all my guys have a knife or a staff, so... We'll just go right to town. First, we'll do a save here. With Glitz, Frankie, Claire, and Morgan. And we'll order these guys a little different here. Just the old habits. Because in the original Final Fantasy... The, monster, the monsters would prioritize the first guy. And then for some reason it always seemed like the fourth guy would get it. Because if you put your Black Mage on the fourth spot, maybe it's just paranoia. But you know, for me, it always go the first guy would get hit. And then if it wasn't the first guy getting hit, because he got hit a lot. You're talking about just straight numbers of how many times they got hit. First guy would get hit a ton. Fourth guy would get hit, second guy would get hit, third guy, rarely. And every single time I've played it, that's what I've seen. So I don't know if it's true or if I just feel that. Let's get the configuration. Curse memory. Continue auto battle. Set auto battle to remain on in the next battle. Uh, okay. Classic. Classic just has scan lines. It's so lazy. Oh my gosh. Classic, standard. That's all we got. We got scan lines or or no scan lines. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Game pad settings, keyboard. Okay. We'll go ahead and save. What does the magic menu look like? See look, and it looks like they did the they did the magic like the classic, which I do like. Because they changed it in the Game Boy Advance version and you couldn't change it back. And I feel like the Game Boy Advance version, you know, we'll see when we play this one. I feel like the Game Boy Advance version was such a, a good version of the game. But they went to mana in that one for some reason instead of the magic points. Because you can see here, if you look on the white mage, you can see that she has MP2 in spot 1. That means she can use 2 level 1 spells. And there's 8 levels of spells. Well, let's get into town here and see what they're doing. Yeah, as soon as they get in the lock me here. Go see the king. Those crystals, you must be see the king at once. He just teleports you there. Oh, that's nice. Welcome, travelers. I am told you carry the crystals. Is this true? Ooh. Look at that. It's just like... Luke Kane's prophecy foretold. When darkness veils the world, four warriors of light shall come. Your Majesty, we cannot be certain of these are the warriors foretold by the prophecy. Yet, they stand before us with the crystals. I cannot dismiss this as a mere coincidence. Crystal bearers, there is a task I would ask of you. Will you rescue my daughter, Sarah? Garland, a knight once in His Majesty's service, has abducted Princess Sarah. I ask for your aid in the name of His Majesty, the King of Cornelia. Garland has taken refuge in the Chaos Shrine, which lies to our north. Of course, we did attempt to save the princess ourselves, but Garland is the finest swordsman in the kingdom. We have one, we have none who can match him. No, we'll see about that. I have heard that you wish to journey to the continent to our north. The bridge leading north was lost long ago, making passage impossible. If you can rescue Sarah, I will have the bridge rebuilt as a token of my gratitude. For now, Warriors of Light, go now, Warriors of Light, and do not fail me. Okay, I shall. I'm gonna go. The dancing girl in town knows many odd bits of information. If you find yourself astray, try talking to her. She may know something that you can put your back on course. Well, that'll be nice. Because this game, this this game, and of course the Dragon Warrior games were so hard to follow. Like I could never beat Dragon Warrior without a guide. It was just that the main parts of the story were just too secret. This game was a little easier. The part where there's a part late in the game that I'll point out that was impossible for me when I was young. I could never beat it. The Warriors of Light have come at last. How long have we waited for this day to come? Garland is no longer the man I once knew. 
I beg you, please return my daughter to me quickly. Well, we can... Let's not go down there. I'm gonna check... Oh, there's direction! Did you see that? There's directional movement. Oh my gosh. The reports say that Garland fled north with the princess to the chaos shrine. I wanna see if I can... I wanna see... If I can... No, I can't... I can't change the background. This has got to be one of the... Every single Final Fantasy lets you change the color of these windows, these menu windows. You know, they even got a lever where they like four points of color you can change. It's really strange to me that they forced me to use this blue the whole time. I do like the addition of the mini-map. You know, there's some quality of life stuff that's really nice. Having a mini-map is really nice. The king is searching for the prophesized warrior of his life. Those crystals, could it be? Yeah, dude, it's me. Don't worry. I got you, boo. Alright, let's go here. What's up? Oh, what's up, bro? My sis, 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 sis. I want my sister. Okay. I'm walking back and forth in front of a fireplace, complaining. The king is searching for the prophesized warrior of light. Those crystals, could it be? Maybe. Maybe. Come on. I can, like... I could scooch right past, I could sneak right past there. I could just scooch right past there, come on. Oh man. I'm ready to talk to that fool. Let's go out here. What's up, guy? Her Majesty, overcome with grief, she's shut herself inside the chambers, please not try to upset her. I am Jane, Queen of Cornelia. Please, please bring my daughter, my Sarah, back to me safely. She didn't... I don't know. She doesn't seem that upset. You know? Kind of like some super rich, spoiled queen that's never spent any time with her kids. Please, please save Lady Sarah. Like, you know, if she was really upset, she'd have like a hunting party out there, not just waiting for some prophecy to happen. Garland was once the greatest knight in the kingdom, but power consumed him and lost sight of who he really was. I guess that does make sense. You know, I never really thought of it that way, that this whole game is like a like a tribute to like power corrupting. You know, because you always kind of thought of it that way, but... Let's go back here and see what we got. Nothing. I thought there was a... Oh, there is. You can come back in here and talk to these guys. What's up? Our ancestor seals weapons within this treasure room 400 years ago. They gave the key to the Elf King to hold until the coming of the Warriors of Light. Okay. The door has been secured. The door has been secured with Mystic Key. Our ancestor seals weapon within this treasure room 400 years ago. They then gave the key to the Elf King to hold until coming to the Warriors of Light. The door has been secured with the Mystic Key. Well, I mean, I came here with the crystals. Can't you guys hold the key? Like, or, I don't know, have like a crystal shaped keyhole. That's what I would do. I think this just leaves. So we know we gotta come back when we have the Mystic Key. Oh, that's neat. We gotta play like that for sure. Let's see how much money we have. 500. We're just buying weapons. Okay. Let's get some of these weapons. Welcome. Welcome. Nunchaku. Oh, that's not even an improvement. A knife is an improvement for him? Yeah, we ain't gonna buy. Oh no, he has a knife. That's a checkbox. I I don't know if I would have done a checkbox. I think I would have done like a green circle. Or just like a gray circle. Or something else. Not not a checkbox. It's like really that's kinda I think that looks like hell. Checkbox. Anyways. Alright. Let's get um a hammer. Attack nine. And then we'll get a rapier. Should we, this stuff is cheap! Oh my gosh, this stuff is cheap!
Isn't he... Isn't... Isn't he need a nunchuck? Wooden nunchuck. Okay. Why wouldn't that be... What does he have equipped right now? A knife. You know, I gotta look up and see when... Man, I can't believe how cheap this stuff is. Holy cow. We might as well go get armor before I optimize them all. That's crazy. They probably wanted to cut down on the on the grinding. That's good chain for him. Another for him. They all got check boxes. Check circles. Thanks a bunch. What is this guy in the say? For the crystal. Oh, it's the dancing girl. What? Let's take a peek at your reflection in the water. Ugh, you're filthy. Use this to wash up. Wow. They they have actually, you know, as someone who's played Final Fantasy 1 many times. I've played Final Fantasy 1 like maybe six times. They've added a lot. It doesn't seem like it because it looks really classic. But the way the grass looks, the way the buildings look. This is Cornelia, the city of the dreams. The way the character controls, you can sidewalk. They got little quirky things. Okay, what does this chick say? Hey there, I'm a dancer. What's that? You want to dance with me? Hee <laughs> hee. Uh, aren't you supposed to tell me? Aren't you supposed to t <laughs> tell me what to do next? Okay, I guess not. The king truly believes in Lu Hawk's, Luke, Luke Han's prophecy, and that the warriors of light will come to save the princess. <sighs> Man, you know, if someone kidnapped my kid, there's no way I'm waiting for like some prophecy guys to show up. Oh, please, you must rescue the princess. Okay. I better be getting paid for all this. You find anything you're liking? Sure do. At 50 bucks a pop, I find a lot to my liking. Okay. Deals damage to undead. Protects one allies. So I think I want to do... I think I want to do Cure Dia Protect. That's 150. Cure Dia and Protect. Okay. Thank you. And then we'll go over here. And we'll go over here. And what's she gonna say? We'll put, oh yeah, I already talked to her. Yeah, uh, fire, sleep. Yeah, fire, sleep, and thunder. Fire, thunder, sleep. Sleep's really good if you get a really big group of dudes. Okay, let's see here. I can forget stuff too. That's interesting. I, I'm pleasantly surprised. They they let you buy, fully equip your entire group. I, I actually, no, I'm not. I don't, I would think it would be better that they would just give you the equipment, the starting equipment, instead of making you just go buy it. You know, wasting a little bit of your time. Yeah, and if you didn't know, White Mage's previous, you know, because Final Fantasy was kind of the, you know, there was class defining in D&D and stuff, but in video games, a lot of, like, heavy traditional class stuff didn't come around till this game. And at that time, uh, holy magic was always with, like, a hammer or something. So, like, White Mages have a hammer up until, like, four, I guess. But... Let's uh, back out of this and we'll talk to this little guy up here. What does he got going on? Okay, so Sage Lucan said something about finding the Crescent Moon. Then he just jumped up and left town. Okay. Okay. What's he got going on? Restore the crystals to grace. It's a well. Looks like you can just climb inside, but you really can't. Hmm. This item shop. See that on the mini map they got highlighted up there? What the stuff is. Please rescue Lady Sarah. Oh, this is to revive people. There are none in need of my services. Do not lose heart, brave warriors. Yeah, in this game you have to go to church to revive them. You can't just revive them. Once lived far to the east of here in the harbor city of Provolka. 
These days I hear it's tuned to Pirate's Den. Okay. Let's go in here. Welcome! Mm, we need some antidotes. And some... Because I, I want to say darkness and silence goes away between battles. Well, at least it used to. Right? Partially restores the party's HP can only be used in the field. So I only have enough for one antidote to buy that. That's not... Poison, you know, obviously I haven't played... This is my first playthrough of Pixel Remaster with everyone watching. I don't know how prevalent Poison's going to be, but I can tell you that I carried a lot of antidotes. That's just something that I would do. Okay, let's make our way out here. We'll grind a little bit. And we'll make our way up to the Chaos Shrine, which is where we're supposed to go. There's the bridge the king was talking about. The swinger. Whoa! Oh man, I don't know if I like that. Okay. So there's a button up top. I see the button up there? Oh. Oh, okay. So if I hit X, they just all auto. Did it go faster? Let's take a look at that. We'll do a we'll do a battle. We'll do a battle with me controlling the battle, and then we'll do one with auto battle. I don't like that flick in. Okay, we'll attack, attack, attack. Oh, these guys are super weak. They have definitely made this game way easier. I gotta look at that screen too, because it looks like to me they didn't gain any experience. Oh no, it says he's got 10 experience. Holy cripes, I move fast on the map. Jeez Louise, they really sped the sucker up. You know, that's crazy how fast I'm moving on the map. Oh, that's right, this time we wanted to do the fast this. No, it's not any fast forward. I think it's just an auto balance. Yeah, so Blitz, Claire, Morgan, and Frankie all leveled up. Oh man, they jumped up a lot. You see that? Oh, look at this. Uh, let's be him. Tribute to Vivi. Okay. Uh, what we're going to have to do... Let's save here. What we're going to have to do is we're really going to have to look and see what the controls are going into this. I want to go in here, but, you know, because these guys are so easy. Okay, here's a here's a group of nightmares, which they call a crazy horse now. Okay. All right. So there was a pause restart, list page list up, start stop auto battle. So that's not actually a fast forward, that's an auto battle. I kind of like this. It gives me a chance to chill and I'm not just... Because later on, you're going to... Later on, there's so much time you're going to spend. Like, setting who attacks where. You know, because on the older one, uh, on original Nintendo, the, the attack wouldn't carry over. So if you attacked a guy that was already dead, you did not get that attack it would just miss it would swing at nothing the attack carryover didn't come on till i want to say the ps1 version of this all right claire let's i don't i don't like that forget is right next to use that's for sure look at that it looks just like use forget it use it forget it use it man that didn't that didn't heal very much at all i gotta go back Let's head back. Ch -ch -ch shuffle my hands. Shuffle, shuffle, shuffle my hands. Shuffle, shuffle. Oh. I do like this guitar riff, though. Really good. Okay, why does it show... This is what I'm wondering, right? Why does it show zero XP across all four characters? It says next level at 
doesn't make any sense. Because they're getting experience for these battles. I really... I want to say that my... The mini-map... The mini-map and the music are definitely the top two in this game. Like, for sure. It's unbelievable how good the music, the remastered music is. Alright, let's go in here. Take a look at this. 30G? That. Now we're gonna... Let's take a look here. Yeah, see, we're already up to three... If you look at Claire here, we're up to three level one abilities now. That should help out a lot. Let's uh let's be let's be Frankie for a little bit. Oh dang it. Come on. Oh come on! Okay. I said to be more patient. Because I was holding down on the directional pad on this Xbox controller. You know, I might turn on that setting that does the auto battles in between battles. Ah, uh, no, I'd rather just turn it on. Actually. Nice little Because if I get into a battle with nightmares and stuff, I'm going to use spells this time. I'm not going to just let them crap all over me. And I, it's as simple as hitting X. It's like not that big a deal at all. See. I'm wondering if this XP thing's going by so quick, I'm not seeing it. That has to be it. Alright, let's go up here. Let's take a look at this. Uh... Ooh. Look at this map. I like this map. Okay. I'm just trying out some of the different buttons right now. Play Claire for a little bit. See if Claire's lucky. See, yeah, I like that you can make that mini map so. Whoa! Uh, let's try these guys. Do you think they hate fire? Let's try it out. We actually haven't seen any of the spells yet. So this is gonna be a first. After I hit this. I haven't seen any spells in the Pixar Mass. Let's go. Let's go ahead. Let's go ahead. Fire. Oh, wow. That looks really good. They, they made this spell look so much better. Yeah, it was there. It went by really quick. I'm wondering if you get, once you start getting a lot of experience for killing stuff, like hundreds per battle, that it ups your, that it it starts scrolling as soon as it shows up, but I'm only getting like 10 experience, so it scrolls through by the time I get a chance to look at it. Oh! One of the hardest playthroughs I've ever done in Final Fantasy was I did only a red mage. A red mage, a thief, a warrior, um, and, a, and a black belt. That was a tough one. Because you once when you get late game, the healing spells are so strong. Oh wow! Uh, how's my health? I can't look that good. Let's protect. Morgan. I'm a little worried that he's going to get stomped on. Spread the damage out a little bit. They de they give the black mage way more. Look at that, 72 health? That's crazy. In the old games, in the old version, like I'd say the PlayStation 1 version especially, because the PS1 version is probably the closest to what the original game was like, except with the really small improvement. Well, it had a big visual improvement, but improvements in the sense of like, you know, attacks would carry over the next guy, that kind of thing.
But in that version, the health was very similar. So, you know, the Black Mage had like a third of the health. We go back, we heal up, and then we go do this chaos shrine. Go back to castle. We heal up here. Thirty G. When they turned it, I wonder. I wonder when they turned it to Gil in Final Fantasy from G, because it was always just. Oh, it was Gil. They well, they have it Gil in here. I don't know. Maybe they did have it as Gil in the first one. Oh, look at those water effects. Wow. <laughs> they put a lot of care into this. I'll say I was worried because it was such a big pack, six games. Six Final Fantasies completely redone, new music and everything. I was like, man, this seems a little rushed, but I, so far, I feel like they've done a really good job. So, as long as they didn't balance it to be too easy, I think this will be a good one. So I'm going to save this here. And I will see you on the next video in Episode 2. Thanks for watching.